Sherehe ya kumkaribisha rasmi nyumbani mbunge wa Budalangi Rafael Wanjala aliyekuwa gavana wa Kakamega Weekly for Paranya aliwaarifu wanachama wa Azimio kuwa kuna maagizo kamili kwa wabunge kupinga mswada wa fedha wa mwaka 2023 wale LPs wa Azimio wale wako katika National Assembly waungane pamoja waone ule mtuada wa finance bill 2023 umeanguka sisi tumesema kufikia mande baba atachoa mwelekeo na kama hawazalimu amri sisi tutaleta pressure hadi washikishe uko tayari jamani uko tayari kurudi maandamano na kama ishara ya ushirikiano mbunge wa Budelangi Rafael Wanjala na mbunge wa Bumula Jack Wamboka wameapa kutii maagizo yaliyotolewa na tutapinga tu itakuwa mambo hatari kule bunge mkae kwa tv sisi tunao kabiliana na wao tuone wale wako na wananchi na wale ambao wanajitakia matofu yao kukufu mbona wale watu wanaleta sukari unatoa ushuru unasema wasitoe ushuru na sisi tunataka kutoza ushuru Ushuri natoka kwa bidhaa si kunyanyasa sisi na katika sherehe za kutuza wanafunzi wa shule ya sekondari ya Thriva eneo bunge la Mavoko kaunti ya Machakos bunge ya Mavoko Patrick Makau pia ameunga mkono viongozi wengine kupinga msoda huo wa kifedha kwani utazidisha mzigo wa gharama ya juu ya maisha kwa wananchi na kuathiri uchumi wa nchi It is says 20% exercise duty on fertilizers that means The fertilizer will be expensive for the distributors. Then the distributors will pass it to the farmer. It also says on mobile money transfers they are going to charge 15%. That means every time you spend you send money on Mpesa they take away 15% of your money. Na mbunge wa Bubasi katika kaunti ya Kisii Innocent Obiri amepinga vikali msada huu akisema uchumi hautakuzwa kwa kuwatoza wananchi ushuru zaidi. You grow an economy by less tax on the people so that business people can create wealth. Let me be counted as again is that bill whatever the consequences but let me not be part of those people who are going to vote for a bill which i know is totally wrong in the management of the economy na kuhusu mjadala kuwa wa Kenya wanatozwa ushuru wa chini ikilinganishwa na mataifa mengine Kenya is one of the most developed countries in Africa because the tax is low so if they want to tax more they want to take us back where those poor african countries are sasa kamati ya bunge ya fedha ambayo imekusanya maoni ya wadau mbalimbali inasubiriwa kuwasilisha ripoti yake bungeni ili ijadiliwe Harriet Chimea K24